doesn't love butterflies, right? Today we're gonna be doing a butterfly. I love butterflies. I mean, when you see them fluttering about, you're just like, oh, it just naturals nature's beauty. So we're gonna start smack dab in the middle of our paper. We're gonna start with a head. So you're just gonna do a circle. And a butterfly's body looks a lot like a dragonfly's body. So you're gonna come here and then you're just going to make it long. Same thing, come here. So I've learned a lot of amazing facts about butterflies and uh, the, this is a monarch butterfly and they spend their winters in Mexico. Then they travel 3,000 miles to Northeast uh, US and Canada for the summer. That's 100 miles a day. 100 miles a day, they are flapping their little wings to get where it's warmer. Okay, outside here, let's do the antennas. You're just gonna go straight out. And at the end, kind of will end on them. I think that is simply amazing. And let's see, we're gonna make, so you wanna come down just a little bit, make a little mark. We're like, okay, this is where our wings are gonna come out. So we're gonna make our wings go straight out. Whatever you do on one side, you do on the other, right? So we're gonna make this one come out. Good job. And then the wings come out this way. So they're shooting out that way. Hmm, so where are we gonna put that? Let's say we'll put it out this way. So make this one come out. So it's gonna kind of curve around. So we're gonna make it curve and then come up. Curve and then come up. Excellent job. Adult females lay tiny, tiny, tiny little eggs and they're covered with this sticky substance on a milkweed leaf. And the leaves are actually poisonous, but the butterflies um, are immune to it. It doesn't affect them. But what happened is when they, after, let's see, after several days, the little eggs hatch, bloop, and then they live off of the plant. And they eat it and they eat it and eat it. It doesn't affect them, but it is now in their system and it becomes, they become poisonous. So you don't want to eat the butterflies. That's like their protection. Isn't that so amazing? I think it's amazing. Okay, so off of here, you'd be surprised. You want to get up a little higher. You want to bring this down from all the way up here. I know. And then it's going to come out here. And in the bottom, it's going to have like a scalloped edge. See how pretty that is? So you can same thing, come out here. And the bottom, give it a scalloped edge. So whatever we do on one side, we are gonna do on the other side. So I'm gonna draw the lines. There's gonna be a lot of Sharpie black. So let's do the first one and then bring it back in. So now we're gonna do the same thing on this side. Come out and bring it back in. Now we've got three large shoots coming off of here. So we're gonna do make the first one. It's gonna go straight out and at the end a little jaggedy and make it come back in. And we're gonna be putting Sharpies in between all of that. So we got another one and come back in and then we'll do one more. So now let's do the same thing on this side. It's gonna come straight out, come back in, have another one come out, in, the last one over here and in. So those are the big ones that we just did. Now do the big ones down here. Actually, we'll just finish off. So now, whatever we do on one side, we're gonna do the other side. So we're gonna do a big one and two smalls. You guys can do them however you want. So we have a big one, and I'm gonna do two smalls. So I'm gonna do the same thing over here. Big one, two smalls. So now I'm gonna do, I have three in a row here. It's kinda of like one, Two, we're only gonna fit in two in on this side. Oops, that's okay. As long as you're doing the same on both sides. Now around the whole thing, I have a bunch of little circles. So we're gonna do circle, circle. So you wanna do this all the way around. These ones are gonna be white. We're not gonna be coloring those in. Make it go all the way down. 
Okay, and now let's do one more row here. And we will be continuing this on the other side. Good job. So let's do the same thing on this side. We are going to do, did I make these? You know what, I don't even think I made these come out far enough. Mm, I might make these come out a little bit farther because it looks like there's a lot of room over here. So I'm just gonna make bring them out just a little bit. That'll be better. Okay, so now I'm going to be putting the circles all the way around here. Uh, I have got a funny for you. Do you guys want to hear the funny? Yes, you do. My dad decided that one day he just was going to throw the butter, a stick of butter out the window. <laughs> I'm like, dad, why, why did you throw the stick of butter out the window? And he says he wanted to see a butterfly. Yeah, yeah, it's a joke. <laughs> you got a funny. Okay, make it little circles. Now we're gonna make one more row of circles. Now, I really don't think I made this, this one as far out as this one. That was my mistake. I might have to bring this out just a little bit. So I'm gonna bring this out a little bit more so then this is gonna come out. Let me make this one come out. That was my mistake. Okay, let's do another row of circles. I'm just gonna put another circle in there. Circle, 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 circle down. Okay, so now we're gonna do the bottom half. So you are going to make, we'll make the, the one that's coming right along the edge here. Make it come in. Do the same thing on this side. Okay, so then let's do the next one to come out. If yours looks different than mine, that is okay. So it looks like I did three on one side and two on the other. Oh my. We're gonna stick another one in there. So we're gonna have one here. So I like the three. So we have three. So right now we're gonna do another one and then one more. And then now we're gonna have little pieces coming off of here. I so did not do this the same. That's okay, every butterfly looks a little different. So we're just putting smaller ones here. One, two, three, four, I might do one more, five. Same thing over here. We're gonna do one, two, three, four, five. And then now we're gonna do some little ones, circles. Now the next one is gonna be sharpening. So I'm gonna make it go, if I can figure it out in fast motion because sharpening is gonna take a while. It's just going around all of it. So the nectar and water are tasted through the sensory hairs on their legs and feet. I guess you can't see the legs and the feet in this picture. Interesting. And the monarchs smell with their antennas. They smell with this and they taste with their feet and their legs. Hmm, interesting. Okay, it is now Sharpie time. So we're gonna start sharpening the whole thing. I'll make this go a little quicker. Now you guys want to get out your eraser and you want to erase any of those pencil marks you have that you don't want to look at. So erase those in there. So how I got these colors, for the, even the background, I just have four colors. So we're going to start with our golden yellow. And you want to don't color any of the outside. Those are all white little dots. But color these in, press down hard, and as you come in, you can go a little bit lighter. Do the same thing over here. Press down hard. If you guys have not subscribed to my channel, subscribe. And so then you know when my next video comes out, it'll let you know. 
Okay, there you go. All right, I'm gonna color these in. And then a little bit in here, and as I come in, I'm just gonna start fading in because I'm gonna do some orange. So now that that part is done, oh, I'm gonna put a little bit of yellow up here in these ones. A little yellow up here. Okay, so now I want you to take the orange. This is the, actually this is the yellow orange or you can just do regular orange. I want you to color the rest of it. This nice orange, we're gonna get some red in there too. But, and then we're gonna blend this in. Do you see how I'm going a little bit lighter? A little bit lighter in here. We will get orange in, and red in there. Kind of blend on top of that yellow. And while I still have this one, I'm just gonna go around the edge. You see how I just went around a little bit on the edges here? It really is just gonna make it pop out with the color. See that? Just do that or go around the edge on all of these right here. Great job. Same thing on this side. And I might give it a little burst of orange over here. Just a little bit. Then we're gonna come in with our red. Give it a little pop of color. So I want you to come in with your red. And if you can see up here, we've gotta pop some color and red in there. Great job. And I'm just gonna blend it as I'm coming down. I'm just gonna make it go lighter. Darker the top part, lighter down the bottom. Okay, so all you have to do now is just take your, this is light blue and just give it a background. So you guys get to work on that. I'll catch you guys later, bye.